Hi guys, Avi once again from the Leopard Trails guiding team. Now this next clip we're about to show you is of a particular sighting we had with one of the 2-2 Vahergala cubs, a sighting that lasted over two hours. And this clip shows how we were able to observe the leopard's behavior and follow her and this led us to a nice surprise at the end. Have a look. This is one of the 2-2 Vahergala cubs. This particular individual is one of the females. There were two females and one male in this litter. If you look at what the female is doing, she's looking very intently on those dead trees at the back there. This was the same direction she was looking in when we found her. She's not taking her eyes off that area, so there must be something that's caught her attention. I think it's probably the crows that are in those trees. This could mean that there is a dead animal in the area. So let, let her settle down and then try and follow her. I observed one of the pictures I'd taken of this leopard and I noticed a tiny white strip at the top of her nose. We then lost her visual for about half an hour. When we found her again, I noticed that this little white strip had gone all red and this indicated to me that she had either fed on a carcass or been close to something that was bleeding. I spent 10 minutes scouring the area with my binoculars trying to find any signs of the carcass but I could not. She kept watching this leopard and then she surprised us all. This is why we didn't see the kill at first. It was because he was hidden behind this log that this leopard was just sitting on. From the looks of it, it's very very fresh. It looks like all three of the cubs have fed on it because there is nothing much left of this carcass. Now that she's uh, finished feeding on this axis deer, she will clean herself to remove any signs of blood or stains that are on herself and then she will most probably end up sleeping because leopards get very lazy after they're fed. I think we will leave her to it as well. 